Hi, and welcome to That's So Nova. My name is Nova, and welcome. If you're first time here, welcome. If you're a subscriber that normally comes, thank you for coming to this one. I am doing a, a short tutorial, because once you see how fast it is, you'll understand why I'm saying it's short, to install um, hardware onto metal chains. I recently just posted a bag, and I said I was going to uh, I posted a bag where they use chains instead of a, a strap and I wanted to show you how to do it because I didn't know how to do it until a couple days ago. Me and my husband had a lot of trials and error and like two people had to hold down the pliers and once I got these a certain <laughs> once I got these one pliers these vice grips it became fairly more easy. So let's go down here. Okay, so in the video, I have this beautiful chain. I bought this chain many, many moons ago from Bringberry. Um, and it has like a nice connector and then an opening. So I wanted to show you, these are um, vice grips. The idea is, is that you don't wanna have to pull out like this because you're gonna, <laughs> this is where me and my husband both had to do it versus squeezing and it separates so that that is a huge thing. So what you need to do is you need to go to a link. You need to put your plier in. And there's different, this one I particularly have has different heads that I can interchange too. And you squeeze open and the link is open. That's it. And then to close the link, you just need a pair of pliers. Um, if you don't want to scratch up your hardware, you can put fleece in the middle or you can sand down the grooves. I know the right tool means everything. So then now you have your link. All right, so I'll do it again. This is another Springberry. There are there are um, chains that are pre-made that have the um, have like a swivel clasp on it. Emmeline Bags has a lot. Um, Serial Bag Maker has a lot too. And there's various places on Etsy that you can get. It. Um, these are just Springberry. Like, I like to treat myself at least once or twice a year to um, Springberry's hardware. Karen, I believe, is the owner, and she has phenomenal like hardware pieces. But at the same time, I love the chains from both Emmeline and Serial Bag Maker. They Anne has a lot of exclusive colors that are only to her shop, so I highly suggest people to go there because that's what make her what makes her super unique. But at last we're gonna do this again we're gonna i'm gonna grab a chain you see it's not open it's magic <laughs> then we're gonna stick our tool that's our vice grip and then i'm gonna squeeze you have to kind of wedge it in there and it's open. I'm gonna open it up a little bit more. Put my swivel clasps on there. Then I grab my pliers. And again, if you don't wanna scratch your hardware, either um, sand down the, the ridges or put a piece of fleece or like material so that it doesn't scratch up your beautiful hardware. You did all this work, you don't wanna mess up your hardware. I almost pinched my finger off. That wouldn't be the first time or the last. You take your, you have your swivel class now. You have everything that's chained up. So very quick, tool, uh, easy um, tutorial. So you can get your chains. I will list Springberry. I will list um, Serial Bag Maker. I will list Emmeline. Um, and go on Etsy and you can explore, explore it as well. So I got the vice grip and then a pair of pliers. That's it. Make sure your tool, you can squeeze out and it opens versus you trying to use a pair of pliers that way. I can tell you, I can tell you right now, the other way is tedious and it's almost a two person job and <laughs> it's a long time. You can do it, but this saves you a little bit of time and it's a useful tool that you use in our sewing day to day. So if you have any questions in reference to this, um, this, uh, 
mini tutorial, please leave the comments down below. I'm more than willing to answer anything, especially if I have any knowledge. If I don't, I'll try to seek it out and help you. <laughs> um, I really appreciate you coming by. So if you can like, subscribe, comment down below, hit that notification bell. And if you think this video is worthy, you definitely share it. Um, I would greatly appreciate it. It helps out our channel. Until the next time I see you, happy sewing.